Milk is in hell, burning in the lake of fire right now. And unless you perverted homosexuals, repent of your perverted homosexuality, you will all likewise perish in hell. Jesus Christ died on the cross to set you free from your sins, the bondage of your sins, and to pay for your sins. Do not be a loser like Harvey Milk and trample the blood of the Holy Son of God underfoot. You have an opportunity to have your sins washed from your soul, to be set free from the bondage of your sins by the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. Do not pass up this opportunity to repent of your sins. Harvey Milk is in hell. Do not join him. For hell is the second death, the lake that burns with fire and brimstone, where the flame is never quenched, kindled by the sin-stained souls of the wicked. I tell you that God sets the standard for what is good and what is love. God is light, and in Him is no darkness. If you are not in the light, if you are not in agreement with God and His Holy Word, you are a liar, and you are in the dark. The truth is not in you. You need to be in agreement with God, the holy God of the Bible, that says homosexuality is an abomination. It is a perversion of the natural order that the holy righteous God of the Bible has set up. It is appointed for man to die once, and after death comes the judgment. We come out here out of love for our neighbor, to warn you to escape from the wrath of God, for the wrath of God abides upon the sons and daughters of disobedience. If you are not in agreement with God, you are in agreement with the world, and a friend of the world is the enemy of God. Who here will stand up for what is right? Who here will stand up for the holy, righteous, loving, good standards of God who sent His Son to die for your wicked souls. I am a living testimony to the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. Just a year and a half ago, I was deep in my sin, pornography, masturbation, idolatry, but because of the blood of Jesus Christ, because of the mustard seed. Get the police. Get the police. Are you married? Because of the blood of Jesus Christ, this wicked witch can be set free from those wicked desires in her heart. Because of the blood of Jesus Christ, I forgive her. I forgive all my enemies. I pray that God will grant her repentance. The repentance that's not repented of. The repentance that leads to salvation. Jesus Christ can set every single one of you free if you would just be brave enough to confess your sins. If you would admit your sins to God. If you would admit your homosexuality is wicked. God is faithful to forgive you and forgive you of your unrighteousness, cleanse you of your wickedness, and give you a clear conscience before God. Where at? God's waiting on your
name of Jesus Christ, there's still hope for you. You can repent of your sins. You can turn to the only living God of the Bible. He will forgive you if you will admit your homosexuality is sin. But the Bible says, if you say you walk in the light, but you Why walk in you darkness, you, you are a liar, the and the right. truth is yeah. not in you. The Bible says that all liars will have their part in the lake of fire. Turn to Jesus Christ. Escape the wrath of God. Hey, don't push me, man. Don't push me, man. No pushing, no pushing. Yeah. Don't put your hands on the Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God, who died for your sins, can set you free. Do not believe the lies of the devil that says you were born gay. The Bible says you must be born again. You must be born again in the spirit of the Holy God. If you would call out to God, ask for repentance, He might grant it to you. He might have mercy upon your wicked souls. Oh, look, when the policeman shows up, when the judge shows up, don't push me, bro. Don't push me, bro. Hey, man, don't push me, bro. Don't push me, bro. Hey, man. Get out of here. Get out of here. You fucking. Oh, my God. Get the fuck out. Oh, my God. Why are you hiding? Why are you hiding? Go back in the fuck. Y'all are insulting because you are not creating anything here. Go back in the lane. Why are you hiding out of God's way? Hey, don't push me, man. Don't push me. Okay. You guys need to turn to Jesus Christ. Why are you still coming? He won't Jesus kill you Christ. and raise your God. He's your only hope. He won't kill you and raise your God. Hey, don't push he me, man. Don't push me. Don't push me, man. He won't kill you. I'll take it. Any of you people that die in your sins are going to go to hell. You need to repent of your sins before you die. Jesus says if you die in your sins, you will go to hell. Your churches are lying to you. You have the library. Come on now. What? You have the library. I'm in pu public library. Yeah? Come on now. You have the library. Okay. Stop all that. Okay. You're in the park, but you have the library. Okay. You have the library. Okay. What? What? Why, why, why aren't you talking? This guy keeps threatening me, man. I didn't threaten nobody. Who I threatened? Me. I Liar. I threatened you. Let's be quiet. I threatened you. Hey, man. Let's go. All right? Jesus Christ is the way that you're going to run for me.